What's going on, fellow cord cutters? Antoine here with Cord Cutter Lifestyle and Tech, and today we're going to be taking a look at a potential up and coming streaming service called Stroom, S T R U U M. So, similar to Voodoo, Stroom is a pay to play streaming service. But with Stroom, instead of paying with cash, you pay with credits. Now, the only way I can simplify this is think about Dave and Busters. When you go to Dave and Busters, you purchase credits to pay the art. To play the arcade games same thing here you go into Stroom and you use the credits that you purchase with cash to play movies TV shows shorts documentaries whatever you want to watch on their platform All right, that's the only way I can simplify it now also with Stroom they do not create their own content they do not have content uh, for themselves most of their content is available on other platforms but I will say this, and this is a big perk. Most of the, the, the platforms that it is available on, you have to pay to watch it. So they have uh, content from Discovery Plus. They have content from Canopy, which is an exclusive platform available to college students, libraries. Um, they have content from HBO Max, which you have to pay monthly for. HBO Max is going for, what, $14.99 per month. So you are, in a way, getting access to exclusive content. Um, not a lot of that content is available on free platforms, but with Stroom, the main thing I wanted to focus on when reviewing this is their credit system because this is completely new. It's completely new. So right now we're on the website and they are available on every core cutter device out there with the exception of smart TVs. We know how slow smart TVs are to move or to get streaming services on them, but uh, top left side of my screen we see we have my available credits and I will say this go ahead and scoop down here um, when it comes to credits and with Stroom subscription service Stroom does charge a monthly fee so you have to pay $4.99 per month and with that you get 50 credits per month your credits do roll over your credits never expire unless you cancel if you if you cancel the service your credits will expire after one year um, but now since the service is fairly new they are offering uh, extra they are doubling your credits when you sign up so when you sign up you monthly you normally get 50 credits now they give you a hundred uh, same thing here you want to get 20 credits for 99 cent normally it's 10 credits but now it's 20 199 you normally get 20 now you get 40 299 you normally get 30 now you get 60 so they're doubling your credits now to put the credits into perspective most of the content the well, the highest costing content is the movies and the movies generally go for four credits so with four credits you got 50 credits so monthly you can watch a little bit over 50 um a little bit over 10 movies per month and if you look at how much content you watch on one platform per month um, you definitely get more uh, more for your money with the credit system or the Dave, the Dave and Buster system or the RK system and I think it's a great idea but for now let's just browse through their platform so we see the movies go for four credits and also, this platform is a host, a hoster, uh, similar to Roku, Fire, uh, Roku, Fire Stick, uh, not Fire Stick, a Fire Stick create, but Stroom does not create their own content. They're hosting other people's content. Again, with the Dave and Buster's analogy, um, Dave and Buster's does not make the arcade games. They just have them in their facility. Same thing here. Stroom does not create the content. It's just in their platform for you to. Uh, pay to have access to watch and like I said, you know this most for the most part is it's exclusive content most of the content on here You won't find anywhere else for free All right, so right now we in TV and you see the different channels here BBC selects um, You have to be subscribed to BBC select to watch their content All right, so we're just going to scroll down here see what kind of content they have uh, let's go back 
uh, Taste Made. Take we know Taste Made is available on other platforms. Magellan TV. I cross reference some of the Magellan TV content, and we all know that Pluto TV has a, a Magellan TV um, channel. But um, with cross referencing, I didn't see any of the shows or movies on here on Pluto TV. So that confirms that their content is somewhat exclusive. I mean, but if you're not familiar with Magellan, if you're not familiar with Magellan, you know, Supernatural, Yoga, you know, just content that's out of the norm. Content that you can just, you can really watch or you're going to really watch and just sit back and just be interested in the whole way through. Now, this um, Thriller Seeker, these are just the channels that's available on this platform. Deco. Um, side tech now, cooking, this is different genres, your next screen drama, and just going down, uh, going to shorts. Now, shorts tend to be cheaper than TV shows and movies. Most of them go for about one credit. So, if you got 50 credits per month or 100 credits per month, you can watch 100 shorts, right? I'm um, just going down here to see what they got, see what they got going on. So as far as device availability, um, Strom is currently available on every cord cutter platform out there: Roku, Fire TV, uh, Chromecast, Apple TV, iOS, um, Apple TV, Android. You name it, it's on there, with the exception of smart TVs, um, Chromecast. If I didn't mention that, um, how often is content available? Content is available for 30 days after you use your credits. If you want to watch it again, it's going to be 30. Um, it's going to you have to pay for it again. You're going to get 30 more days. Similar to Voodoo, like I said, um, or similar to any platform out there that you have to pay to play. You get 30 days to watch it. If you don't watch it within that time frame, you have to purchase it again. But the cool thing here is your credits never expire as long as you are subscribed. Right, your credits roll over as long as you're subscribed. But if you ever cancel your service, your credits do expire after one year, which is that's 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 a big perk right there. You have one year to use your credits after you cancel your subscription. Ladies and gentlemen, that is it. Um, let me know if you use this streaming service stream and what you think about it. Um, overall, what do you guys think about the stream streaming service? Will it be um, here for the long term? Um, it, do you think it will end up like Quibi? You know, um, but that is it, folks. I will catch you guys next time. Peace out.